Hi there, welcome to the Blinds.com Crafty at Home series. I'm Melissa from the HappierHomemaker.com. Today I'm going to show you how to make really easy pillow covers in less than five minutes. Um, it's getting warm here in North Carolina and I pulled out my patio pillows the other day and they're not looking so hot. They're actually looking pretty gross and so I thought they needed a new look for this spring and summer and so we're going to make some easy pillow covers. Okay, let's get started. You're going to need a sewing machine, fabric, and some coordinating thread. For fabric, you can easily go to the fabric store and buy a yard of fabric. Or for me, I kind of like to find good deals on curtain panels. And because this is an outdoor pillow, I'm actually going to use a shower curtain today. Um, I've cut it to uh, the width of my pillow. My pillow is 17 inches and I cut my fabric to 17 inches. We want the pillow cover to be very full, so I'm going to sew it slightly smaller than the pillow's dimensions. For the length, I've cut it to about two and a half times the length of my pillow. So for my 17 inch pillow, it's 42 inches long by 17. Um, because I've cut it from a shower curtain, one end, one of my short ends is already hemmed, so that saves me a little work. So our first step is gonna be to hem the other short end. And for that, I'm just gonna fold it down about a quarter to a half an inch. I'm gonna add a couple straight pins to hold it in place while I sew it. If you um, use regular fabric, then um, you're gonna go ahead and sew both ends. So the first thing we're gonna do is sew a straight seam along the short end. I folded it over about a quarter to a half an inch and used my straight pins to hold it in place and we're just gonna sew one straight seam right across the end. Now we're going to fold the fabric over on itself to form our pillow cover. We want to make sure it, um, when it's folded that it measures about an inch less than the, the width of our pillow. So I want this one to measure about 16 inches after it's all folded together because I want it nice and, and tight on my pillow and there's going to be a good amount of overlap. I, I like to do a lot of overlap because this is an envelope style closure pillow uh, because that way you don't chance the pillow showing in the back. So what I've done is I've just folded it over onto itself and I'm going to add a couple pins just to hold it in place and then all we're going to do is sew the two sides a one straight seam down each side. After you finish your last two seams, just flip your pillow cover inside out and go ahead and put your pillow in it and you instantly have a nice decor update. I'm Melissa from the happierhomemaker.com and this has been blinds.com crafty at home. See you next time.